guys, Max Hill here, and if you're owning a OnePlus One, you'll be waiting for two things. Number one, Sun Engine Mod 12, and number two, Oxygen OS, a ROM especially for OnePlus One, built by OnePlus One. And so, without further ado, this is the Oxygen OS 1.0, and it is based on Android Lollipop 5.0.2. And so, it's not the latest version of Android, but an update to 5.1 might be coming soon favorite feature in this is in the notification center so if you go ahead and click the quad box up there um, you can move uh, you can move and enable and disable toggles what you want in your notification center I think this is a very cool feature very handy in um, um, rush time and you want your favorite settings there so it's a very good thing the feature which you can recall from Cyanogen mod 11 is gestures Obviously, like double tap to wake, draw a circle to open camera, draw a V for flashlight. So, it's there from Cyanogen Mod 11, 11S. So, it's not the best feature because sometimes it doesn't work, but it does work uh, most of the time. But And it can activate while it's in your pocket. So, it's not the best feature, I would say, but it's there for the one who needs it. Next feature is buttons. So, you can have on screen or on uh, off screen buttons like the capacitive buttons or the buttons which is on the screen well i like the on screen button so i'll leave it there one other feature is in the multitask menu so if you go ahead in the multitask menu there's a x button on the top right corner so if you click that it'll close all the applications just at once instead of you manually closing each one uh, it'll save you a lot of time so this is a very handy feature it's a good feature and there's this, the camera app. By default, it uses the Google camera app, which takes great pictures though, but doesn't support 4K videos. So, you have to download the OnePlus One camera, or the Cyanogen, that is the Cyanogen Mod camera, to take 4K videos. So, that's not a good thing, which Cyan uh, OnePlus One did. And that's not the only thing. It doesn't have screencast already installed, just like in Cyanogen Mod does. So, you have to install SuperSU to get root access and then install screen, say, uh, screen recorder so that is a good feature which many of them might use so they didn't think about that it's bad of OnePlus even bad that it does not have a theme store that was a good thing from Cyanogen mod I think they should include it in the next update so basically this is it this is uh, Oxygen OS by OnePlus so I think this needs a lot of inclusions and fixes, so I guess in the next uh, update they should probably do this. Uh, let's see about that. But then I think we should upgrade to Cyanogen Mod 12S.